time. Time for leisure, relaxation. Time to play and have fun. You know how to have fun, don't you? Remember when time was affordable and plentiful? Back when you had all the time in the world without all the worries and concerns you presently suffer from? Why, Dr. Pinkerton, you might be saying. I was younger then. My feeble, stupid mind must be misremembering. Well, you're wrong. Except for that part about you being stupid, you are completely wrong as usual. Yes, there was indeed more time back then. Utilizing our highly sensitive atomic clock, we of the COG have been researching for the last five months into this universal problem of missing time. My findings indicate that over the past two decades, time has contracted to the point where all your available time is spoken for. As a matter of fact, you probably are supposed to be working instead of watching this right now. Fools! What if I told you that somebody had identified the individuals responsible for robbing you of your precious time and actually had formulated a plan for dealing with this issue? A sage, learned man, beloved by all. Oh, that would be me. Hi, how are you doing? Silence! Oh. No! You'd probably say, why, a man smart enough to figure this out must be literally twice as intelligent as anyone else on this planet. To that I would reply, Cog, congratulations for once in your life. You are precisely, uncharacteristically correct. Behold, my latest achievement, the greatest advancement in modern surgery ever realized. I, Dr. Milo T. Pinkerton III, am now the first human being to have successfully upgraded my brain to dual core. Get a shot of that, Dr. C. Yes, following my successful think tank breakthrough last year. I have crafted a secondary neural processor to my own cranium. And believe me, the thoughts that I am now capable of thinking are far beyond those of any person on this planet. Stand by for a critical announcement that will change your lives forever. forever.